Hello everybody, it's Teenips95 and I'm back. And we were where we were last time. Anyways, last episode we got the nightmare key and the Pegasus boots. I'm sorry I said that like wrong like five million times last episode. Dang it. Anyways. Um first things first, we have to go do this actually there was this thing we couldn't get through it last time but now that we have the pegasus foot and I know what to do we can get the third key that we need so now we switch to our power bracelet um switch back yeah I press the right button yay we're progressing and uh, come on okay okay so we had this glob we couldn't get to last time and now we can and we kill it actually we probably could have gotten to it before if I was smart but I'm not anyways here is you got 200 rubies you are a big word Anyways, um, now what we should do is, yeah, while I was exploring, I kind of opened this door on accident, so I thought, well, I might as well go through it, but if you hit the thing like I just accidentally did, you go upstairs, and you can go into this chest, which you find the stone beak. Let's find out what the owl, which owl statue it belongs to. It belongs to all of them. And if you go this way... You can kill all of them in one swipe, because you're awesome. But, in here is the map. <laughs> At last, you got the map! Start. I could have used this map a while ago. Anyways, now that we got everything, we can go to the boss of bossiness. If I go the right way... Oh, I hate this bird so much! <gasps> I just do, don't ask why. Anyways, if you go up and you go left, I think that's left, anyways, yeah, that's left. You can unlock this, and you can unlock this, and you can unlock this, and you can unlock that. Well, not unlock it, but anyways, if, if you can swipe at it all you want, but this is what you have to do. Boom! Ha ha, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it. Anyways. Um, wrong button. Okay, boom. Okay, okay. Piranha plant, wrong game. And this is actually quite easy if you know what you're doing. Like I do, you've got a piece of power, just what I needed. Um, we charge. Okay, so. Um. Okay, so. If you kill all these bats, like so, you will somehow, some reason, get a key. Which I find that quite stupid, because, I mean, it's the end of the dungeon. Why would you have a key there? Anyways, you gotta charge into the wall, and a giant eyeball will fall! And what you have to do is you have to split it in half. Which could be a very big pain because he moves and you gotta hit it in the middle. Constantly. Or else he'll go back to normal. Like so. And... If you get it done correctly... <sighs> this can be difficult. And I want to do this before my piece of power runs out. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yes! Anyways... They will jump up in the air, and... And when they jump up, they will do that. Except for, I just killed them. And we get our seventh heart container. To find a bell. We've got the Sea Lilies Bell, and we're awesome. Yes. Are 
Yes. And we get a secret message. Right. About. Now. Waterfall. It is hidden in the waterfall. Yes, it's hidden in the wall. Waterfall. Mr. Owl! Who, how many instruments have you gotten so far? When you play the instrument in front of the egg, the windfish will wake and you will leave this island. Now, you must hasten to the Yarn Desert. The dark, mysterious inhabitants of the sand will show you the way. Hoot. <laughs> Anyways, over here you jump. I'm surprised he didn't jump over me. And we go up. And no, we don't go up yet. We go this way. Okay, so in here, I'm gonna have to do this anyways, because I need rubies. There's, I think there's 50 rubies in here, but it, I mean, it's annoying, but it's not difficult. And boom. There we go. I could not do that last time without getting hurt, because I'm impatient. Anyways, there's this here. Push that that way, and you get 50 rubies. Very nice. Yeah, very nice. Uh, boom, and then boom. And we run out of here without getting hurt. Thank you. Anyways, I hate those caterpillars. Hey, it's Tarin, but, but first, we're going to bomb this. Because we are awesome. And we create a shortcut for ourselves. Oh, Link, I see you have a nice stick. Can I borrow it for a second? Yes, you can. He just cut that with a stick. That was awesome. Poke the beehive with a stick. Yeah, that's right, Taryn. Mess with the bull, you get the horns. Yeah, anyways. We're gonna steal his honeycomb. The stick became a honeycomb. No, it's in it. You're not sure how it happened, but take it. Uh, yes, we take it. Anyways. Um, right in here, I believe, is a fairy fountain thing. Um, yes, she's not in there right now. I don't know how all that works. I will find out for you guys, though. For my whole six subscribers out there at the moment. Um... But yes, we need to go to Animal Village to go find animals of Animalians. Yes, I just said Animalians. And there's Marin. Yeah, I just, I thought Taran and Marion were husband and wife, but no. I was really wrong. Taran is Marion's dad. Marin's not Marion. Don't Travis. Anyways, we're going to Animal Village because animals are cool. Except for this monkey up here. This monkey can go die. It throws nuts at you. And we pick up the rock and throw it. And I'm gonna, I don't know what's in there. I will find out for that too for you guys too. But it's probably some important. And that can be very annoying if you don't jump at the right time. But yes. So I hate this thing. It drops bombs on you. Stealth bomber. No. Yeah. Anyways. And we go through here with ease. Because Link is awesome. Yes. I actually. I don't know if I've done this yet. But in this thingy majogger of awesomeness. No. Um. Yes, I haven't done it yet. There is a secret seashell. You can collect a lot of these. Something good is bound to happen. How many do we have? We have four. <laughs> I need to collect 20. I believe there's only actually 20 in the game. I don't know. I'll find out. I'm going the wrong way. Of course I am. <clears throat> now we gotta go this way. And over here, you cannot get over there. Unless you do this. And we find... 
out that there's a fishy down here. No, there's a lot of fishies. And we gotta do that, and I just hopped into there. Because I am awesome. But down here is Animal Village! Yay! Okay. So... Yeah, Animal Village is awesome because it's full of animals except for that monkey on the beach. And I almost stabbed the bunny in the face. <laughs> that would have been saddening. But it's a big bat panda bear. Well, it's not a bear, it's a black bear. I want to talk to you. Okay. Hi ho. Hey you. Is it is that possible possibly a honeycomb you have? I just ran out. Will you swap it for a pineapple? Yes. And we get a pineapple. You exchanged honeycomb for pineapple. It's not as sweet, but it's delicious. Hi ho. Yeah, I know that tub of goo is asleep right in the way of yarn desert. Once he's asleep, he won't budge for a long time. But hey, take little Marion and wake him up with her song. That slobble would wake up with a jump if he heard her sing for sure. <laughs> yeah, go away. But down here, if I can get over here, is... Another teleporter! That was a little delayed reaction of saying that. But anyways, I believe I correct myself, and there are actually f four teleporters. Can I? No. Ah, uh, yes. So we gotta go find little Marion. She's in the courtyard. No, she's not. Marion, she likes to go stare at the ocean all by herself. Why? Hey, I'm just a kid. I don't. Don't ask me. I just asked you. So why don't you give me an answer? I have a sword, and you don't. Yes. So we can dash through all this, and jump, and jump, and jump, and jump. Yes, and jump. Ow! And run. Okay. And run. And... Can I throw this at the monkey? Aw, oh, man, I can't. Anyways, down here... Is Marion? I'm gonna sneak up on you. Dang it! Oh, Link, I'm glad you found this place. Will you stay and talk to me for a while? No! Okay, I'll just watch the waves for a while. Anyways, next episode on Let's Play Link's Awakening, we will be talking to Marion. The next episode will have a lot of story in it, I guarantee it. Anyways, so I will see you next time on Let's Play Link's Awakening.